I'm Cal Webster and I'm a Planning Officer at North Devon Council. My name is Alex Miles and I'm the Emergency Planning Officer for North Devon Council. My name is Tanisha Rousewell and I'm an Environmental Health Practitioner and I specialise in HMA licensing and caravan licensing. So in 2022, I was looking for a new start to my career. Um, I was looking at planning and transport planning and various roles similar to that. So North Devon Council were advertising a graduate environmental health officer role. And at the time, I was just finishing a master's in environmental health. So I thought it was a perfect opportunity to kickstart my career. And I applied and here I am today. Eventually was offered an interview here at North Devon Council where um, I was successful and thankfully got the opportunity to um, to start work as soon as possible really and move down here as soon as I could. I was coming to the end of my master's studying crisis and disaster management and I saw the job for emergency planning graduate come up at North Devon Council. I really wanted to work in the southwest as I'd recently completed my dissertation in the area and I knew I really liked it and it seemed to be the perfect fit for me. So I moved, I moved down here towards the end of 2022 and uh, haven't looked back since. Yeah, I've really enjoyed it. I was quite surprised actually being uh, more of a city kid. I spent most of my young adult life in cities and that's what I was looking for when I was actually applying for roles around the country. But actually Barnstable's proven to be a really great place to live and has a lot going on. I work in the private sector housing team with environmental health. As I explained earlier, I do caravan licensing and HMO licensing as an EHO. Um, I am involved with the administering and processing of the licenses. So we've got HMO licenses, holiday caravan licenses, park home licenses and camping licenses. I also undertake inspections and enforcement action where required. My role involves essentially making decisions on planning applications. Um, I'm mostly office based, so I'm looking at plans, looking at maps looking at policy and the general uh, objectives of, of the planning department. So my role is making sure that as a council, we are prepared for a range of different risks and emergencies. So I'm responsible for making sure we have the plans and policies in place so that we can fulfil our duties as a Category 1 responder alongside our emergency service colleagues and other partners. Every now and again, I have to go and visit the site of every planning application, um, assessing the appearance and character, looking at the plans, ensuring there aren't any mistakes, speaking with various stakeholders and, and ultimately making a decision on, on a planning application. Throughout my time at North Devon, I've been involved in a variety of different projects and it's challenged me, but it's also improved my confidence greatly and developed me as an individual. I like the role because it's varied Every, every application that I get or every case that I get is, is different um, and requires a different a problem to solve or a ele different element of thinking. Uh, my role is really varied. I get to work with lots of different external partners such as the police, fire um, and ambulance service to ensure that we have multi-agency plans in place. I also get to work with lots of different service areas within the council as I also lead on business continuity so I make sure that different teams have the correct plans in place to ensure that we can continue to provide the council's core essential services if there was ever a disruption to the business. So my role is incredibly varied. Um, I get to inspect lots of different sites across the district in order to safeguard public health. Moreover, I find a lot of value in my role, knowing that what I do safeguards people, for example, through the, the health and safety inspection of a caravan site or inspecting a property in order to safeguard individual public health. I like it because it sort of optimises the skills that I have. I'm quite good with maps and plans and numbers and drawings. Um, it's physical in that, you know, it's about the physical world and the built form. Um, and then every now and again, you get to drive around North Devon, look at the lovely countryside, look at look at houses and properties and buildings and sites overall. And And gradually as the role progresses, you get to see and learn new things within the job. Um, which I particularly enjoy and it's and nothing's ever the same you know it's always different. So 
I really like the flexible working arrangements. It provides a great work-life balance. So if you worked over your contracted hours each week, you're able to take that back as flexi time at your manager's discretion. The staff have been really positive and patient, um, particularly coming into the role as a new um, employee. They slowly have fed me in new work and increased my knowledge base um, to sort of struck that balance perfectly between not overwhelming me, but still sort of pushing me. North Devon have been incredibly supportive of any training and development opportunities I've wanted to do. For example, I was able to obtain my chartered status through the Chartered Practitioner Programme and I had great support from my managers and colleagues. And at the moment, I'm now involved in the District Council Network Staff Development Programme. And that's an opportunity I'm incredibly grateful, grateful to be a part of and I can't wait to get going with that programme. There's all sorts of training and, and the various opportunities to do with that as well. Um, within planning, so there's RTPI events and Homes England online webinars and all sorts of opportunities to learn while working. And, and luckily, the management here are very supportive of people taking time to progress their careers. I really like the flexible working arrangements that North Devon Council offers. So on some days I work from home, but they also offer flex leave, which means that I have the opportunity to get out and join some of the local area outside of just using my annual leave. So I get the opportunity to finish early on some days, head down to Willacombe or Croyd Beach and get out on my paddleboard.